Yeah, even though we have no idea when the next high school sporting event will be held, plans have to be made. Today, the Michigan High School Athletic Associate announced a big change in the way the high school playoffs will be put together. Gone are the days of needing six wins to get into the playoffs. More weight is being added to strength of schedule, which should help teams set their schedules. And gone are the days of not knowing which division teams will play in until the field is announced. Classifications are now going to be announced well before the season kicks off. I think most people like the fact that they know exactly if they're going to be a Division Three or a Division Six, And uh, I think it'll just be easier for schools now to know exactly who they're going to be competing against. It'll help them scout, and it really just, uh, I think, gives folks a lot more lead time. Class is based on enrollment, and Grand Rapids Catholic Central already knows it'll make the jump from Division Four, where it's the reigning state champ, down to Division Five. That's about the only thing set in stone right now. Until the state lifts coronavirus restrictions, there'll be no practice and certainly no games. Can we return to the old ways of, uh, you know, packed houses and packed crowds and stadiums? That's certainly a great question. Um, you know, we'd love to get back to some summer activity um, just where we can start to get kids together with coaches and, and just to be able to get um, some activity again. But Jack, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I've got a real concern for the fall because now when it comes to Friday night, not just the players, but you're talking the band and student sections and communities coming out. And if uh, our communities can't uh, come together and gather come fall, um, which is part of Americana, the Friday night lights um that's something that uh that, that really is a concern for our schools as well for us but uh we're just continuing to take things on a week by week basis and hopefully um everybody will do their part and we can have uh, a normal fall again after uh, the most abnormal of uh, winters and early springs